On April 5, 2024, there was a magnitude 4.8 earthquake with an epicenter in Lebanon, New Jersey. This main quake was followed by a series of smaller aftershocks. The main quake was felt throughout New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and New York. What caused it? Well, we don't have earthquakes as large or as often as they do in California, but the USGS, or the United States Geological Survey, says that we've had over 40 earthquakes of magnitude 3 or greater in our area since 1950. Why? We are influenced by the divergent boundary under the Atlantic Ocean called the Mid-Atlantic Ridge. On either side of the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, the plates are being pushed apart, and you can see that in these arrows. That push makes its way to us here in New Jersey, which is the red dot here on the map. We also have the Appalachian Mountains in our part of New Jersey. They formed about 480 million years ago as the result of two pieces of continental crust squeezing together. That push has created cracks in the rock, like you see here in red. Those cracks are called faults. The faults are the places where the rocks can move as the mid-Atlantic Ridge pushes us to create the earthquake that we felt and the aftershocks. This map shows all of the faults here in northwestern New Jersey. They're represented by the black lines. The red star is the epicenter of the main April 5th earthquake. The USGS says the motion from these earthquakes is the result of an oblique reverse fault. This means the rocks are being pushed together at an angle, which matches the kind of force the Mid-Atlantic Ridge is putting on those faults here in New Jersey, as you can see in this animation. Thanks for watching.